An idol concert. A place that no one would expect someone such as myself to attend. In fact, I detest concerts. The suffocating crowd. The loud yelling from the audience. The irritating flashing of lights. There are places I'd much rather be. But... That voice. That smile. That face. It keeps me from walking away. What is happening to me? Man, Amy's getting a bit overrated, don't you think? <coughs> like, no offense, but it gets old seeing her face every day. Overrated, you say? Define overrated, Sonic. That woman is simply getting the recognition she deserves. <sighs> wow. And you say you're not a diehard fan. Telling the truth is not obsessive behavior. I'm a fan. Nothing more, nothing less. Sure, buddy. Whatever you say. Oh yeah, you heard that Amy's making an appearance at this fancy restaurant 10 miles away? Just now? When? Tonight. Okay, I'll be going. <laughs> it's a race then. Yeah, <laughs> bring it on. Loser treats lunch for a month. Oh, now we're talking. Honestly, why bother tagging along? Aren't you tired of seeing her face? I just want to say hi to an old pal, Shads. Don't you look at that, sweetie? I told you we'd be successful. I knew I had an eye for lovely talents like you. Yeah, thanks, Miss Rouge. Come on, Amy, you don't need to attend college when you're already famous. Just focus on your career. But you know that I won't be an idol forever. I need some sort of backup job. It's just a few years, and I'll work alongside studying. You know you can just marry a rich guy, right? I don't want that. Amy! Hey, Amy! everyone! Who Gentlemen, are you? no flash photography, Amy! please! We're only trying to eat! I guess it's a tie. A tie? Who would have thought? Hey, Amy! It's me, Sonic! Huh? Sonic? Keep walking, Amy. But Sonic is here. You know him, right? It's not the time for that. <clears throat> you okay, Shads? Damn it. Your food, my lady. Watch what you eat, darling. We both know how you hate hitting the gym. Huh? Do you have to ruin it for me? I don't want to hear it, Amy. I'm working on that college application form you sent me. What? You want to apply to that Institute Eggman made for science and robotics? Why not? I'm not totally incapable of math and stuff. Seriously, Amy? I didn't take you for a nerd. Do you know how dangerous it is for a star like you to attend a public school? Do you have a death wish? Well... I was planning that I could just change identities. Oh, okay. So, you what? You want me to pull some strings to get you forged documents for this new identity? Hmm... <sighs> Fine. I guess being closer to that Sonic would get you to write more songs. Ugh! It's not because of Sonic! Oh, the things we do for love... Stop! Good evening, folks. I'm here live with a lot of eager fans waiting for sweet Amy. Right now, right here at... Huh? Sir, get away from... Come on. Ah! You fool. Do you not understand that by broadcasting her location live means another swarm of people will crowd this area? Have you not seen the staff begging the crowd to stop being noisy? Are you begging for a ride Shadow, to happen? let's just get dinner somewhere. Let's go before things get out of hand. Uh, sorry about that, ma'am. I guess my buddy's trying to minimize the crowd. Here's a little something for the damage. So you're saying that your house burned down in your old country, that none of your class records can be recovered? Yup. Ah, I couldn't care less. As long as you can pay the fees and keep up with our advanced curriculum, you're accepted. <laughs> now scram and figure out your schedule on your own! Why am I so nervous? 
This is exactly like high school, except with girls dyeing their hair pink and matching my hair. And guys wearing my merchandise. We're just right. If I'd come here without a disguise, I could have been eaten alive or something. My face blustered everywhere. But no one's recognized me yet. That's a good sign. I'll just keep a little profile until I- ah! Sonic? Oh, hey, Ames. Ah! Nice to see you finally come around. What the- But- What? How? How did you- Why are you so calm? Hmm. I guess I had a hunch we'd see each other again after last night. Were you supposed to be undercover? Yeah! How did you figure it out? I know my Amy when I see her. I... I'm not your Amy. Yeah? What's your undercover name? Amelia. <laughs> you didn't think that through, huh? You sure changed a lot, Sonic. Hmm? How so? You're so relaxed and laid back. It's not that you weren't like that before, but it feels like nothing could shock or surprise you anymore. What happened, Sonic? Eh, when your roomie's with Shadow, nothing is unpredictable to me. Your roommate's with Shadow? No, seriously, what happened? I guess life just becomes dull when you turn 20. Is it because you're not going on adventures anymore? Or is it because I disappeared? Oh yeah, I got class to attend. Catch you huh? later. Wait up! <sighs> Poor Sonic. Hmm. That girl. No, I suppose it's another fan of her. But she's definitely a new student. If that's you, Amy, why would you try to hide yourself from me? Now that I did catch you talking to Sonic, I'll just ask him myself. It seems like my disguise fooled him a bit. I guess it's because we didn't hang out as much. But he's still my friend. He looks like someone I could trust with my identity. But if I hang out with him or Sonic, suspicion might rise. I'm sorry, Shadow. Pink Hedgehog, you're late! Of course it looks depressing here. Sorry, Dr. Eggman. As I was saying, I am Dr. Ivo Robotnik. You may refer to me as Professor Robotnik if you like. Eggman is more of a brand name, you see. I'm your school director and also science and robotics teacher. Since you've all come to attend this little school I made, you're all probably aware this isn't just any school. This is a school for the gifted minds that want to explore the vast fields of science and robotics. Introducing Eggbot, the most simple mech even aspiring geniuses like you can build. If you're able to construct one that works, then you are fit to be considered a student in this fine institution. Think of this as an entrance exam. It's a harmless little robot that could talk, fly, and walk. Kind of like a virtual assistant, but more entertaining! And yes, you can keep it afterwards free of charge. And no, you don't have to do any sort of programming. All you have to do is screw plates and connect wires together. As long as you know how to follow the instructions of the instruction manual included, you'll be able to pass this test. And don't even think of passing someone else's already built Eggbot. I'll know. Uh, my head hurts. Chaos. I feel so numb and tired and all I did was talk to her. I can't go to class like this. Why is she here? If I hadn't recognized her, she would have kept hiding from me. From us. But why? Uh, I don't think a nap will do the trick. I suggest taking a nap, Sonic! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, hey, Shads. What's up? That girl you were talking to. Who is she? Whoa, hey there. No need to be all interrogative here. Which girl are you talking about? 
You know I'm popular with the ladies. Pink Hedgehog. Oh, her? I forgot her name. <laughs> what do you want me to say? Tell you it could be Amy or something? Man, I guess even the ultimate life form can't sniff out the real Amy. If she isn't planning to reveal herself to anyone, then I should respect that. <clears throat> of course. Of course I want her back. Just... Just like everyone else. Trust me, bud. If it was Amy, I'd tell you right away. But you know, at first, I thought she was Amy, so I followed her around and discovered she's a diehard Amy fan who dyed her fur pink. She's supposed to have white fur as far as I know. Then why were you talking to her so casually? Why not? You jealous that women talk to me? <laughs> I will smother you as you sleep. Knuckles! Get in, loser! We're going shopping! Are we really? Nah, I just wanted to say that line. Ruse asked me to pick you up today. She has a meeting with some important people. But I know she just doesn't want to drive. Well, thanks, Nux. And don't worry. I'll get my dorm situation settled by tomorrow. More free time until the next concert, hmm? I don't mind being your driver for today. And hey, I wanted to ask you about Sonic and Tails. How are they doing there? Or you don't mind because Miss Rouge told you so. Mm. Watch it, Amy. I'm not beyond dropping you off in the middle of nowhere. Hmm. And, uh, I didn't see Tails, but Sonic... Sonic is alright. I think. So, what are you and Miss Rouge, really? Friends, colleagues, and also kind of my boss. She helped me, so I help her, and we share one goal, and it's to make sure you're safe. <laughs> you guys are like my mommy and daddy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, definitely not. <laughs> Aww, you're all red, Nucky. Because I am red, idiot. <laughs> I should make a song about this. No, no, no! You guys really don't have to be protective of me. I can defend myself, and you know that. Without your hammer, you're toast. I'm not 12 anymore. I even got my driver's license a week ago. What's a driver's license? Huh? Say what? <laughs> you should have seen the look on your face. <laughs> Of course I know what a driver's license is. I have one. <laughs> yeah, you got me good. documents laying around just like that. It'd be a shame if someone were to tamper with it. There we go. If Amy can't cute herself into getting funds, I'll do it my way. <laughs> <laughs> 